pier right here, you can see what this quarter is gonna look like. Um, with a lot of glass, these are breakout rooms. My most passionate project right now is making this school available for the future generations of young artists. Growing up in New York City, I was surrounded by the arts and my family as well. I went to the, see the New York City Ballet do the Nutcracker when I was seven and I fell in love. I auditioned and um, got into the School of American Ballet, which is the school, the official school for the New York City Ballet when I was eight. One of the best things about growing up as a ballet dancer is being surrounded by music. At School of American Ballet, we always had live music. So my whole childhood, I had live music accompanying my dancing. The dancers are really like notes on the page of the stage. And I definitely have some of those memories of just being that in that perfect moment of the arts where it's like time and space disappear and the music is surrounding you and you're just in that place. I moved to New Mexico because I was 30 years old and my career as a dancer was over. I had danced in New York City Ballet and with Twyla Tharp's company. I loved New Mexico. I had been here. I had an affinity to the place. It really drew me, so I just decided to move here. What inspired me to create opportunities for young people to participate in the arts was a real recognition of what the arts had done for me as a child. Having ballet in my life transformed my life, and it taught me discipline and focus and tenacity. I went through a period of time in my 30s of really not knowing what I wanted to do, and I was compelled to work with children and give back what had been given to me as a, a young artist. I felt like I was watering the desert, that there was, there was so little arts education in the public schools, and particularly in communities that were isolated. And for some children, watching their progression Seeing that this arts program was the key that unlocked their learning, that unlocked their passion, that unlocked their connection to being in school, I became addicted to it. The New Mexico School for the Arts grew out of National Dance Institute. It's just the most incredible working environment and you really feel like your life has purpose and you get to work with the most extraordinary people who share that same experience with you. And I've had that experience working at NDI and New Mexico School for the Arts of of knowing that you're building something bigger than yourself and willing to put in a lot of personal sacrifice and hard work and time to make that happen. I traveled all over the state. Every place I went, I saw really profoundly talented kids. So we have um, an orchestral rehearsal room, percussion rehearsal, vocal, instrumental, piano lab, and then lots of little breakout practice rooms. And then of course a music library and the music director's office. I think NDI is really established. It's an incredible organization, beautifully run, strong board, great endowment, amazing work. And if I can get the New Mexico School for the Arts in that same place, then I think I will have contributed to children's lives and to the arts here.